It's days after the Islamic holiday of Eid al-Adha, and these Muslim-owned butcher shops aren't just selling meat. They're giving it away. According to Islamic practice, Muslims who can afford it slaughter an animal on Eid al-Adha, but only a third of the meat is for them. Another third goes to their family and friends, and the last third is given to the poor. Most people don't know what to do with large quantities of frozen meat. That's where Muslim butchers and local organizations step in. They don't know the way. They don't know how to give. Not even because of somebody else, if they trust, they know they're going to go the right way. They trust us, we give the good amount of the meat to the needy people. This is Atif Nazir. He volunteers with the Islamic Circle of North America, helping to collect and distribute tens of thousands of pounds of meat during the holiday. Other volunteers are doing the same thing at some 40 locations around the state. It all happens by word of mouth and trust between local groups. We are in a recession right now, you know, so it's just not the Muslim people, it's all people that need help. Some of the Muslims here will take the meat to others that are less fortunate than themselves. Atif has been spending his days after the holiday coordinating butcher shop pickups, but he's too shy to talk about it. I don't understand it. <laughs> Volunteers say it's a simple message built into their religion. Take what you need, give the rest to others.